awful lot of people here who've made a lot of money in technology, and a lot of those people want to give back to the next generation of entrepreneurs. Hello, I'm Chris Cashman. Welcome to News on Main, the place to get connected with the latest small business news. Kiplinger's personal finance rated Austin, Texas, number one on its best cities for the next decade list. Smack in the middle of the action is the Austin Technology Incubator that works with early stage companies to increase their odds of success. In Smart Business, the director of ATI explains why Austin is the ideal place for startups. Austin's the kind of place that rewards success but doesn't punish failure. In Austin, I think perhaps more than some other parts of the country, people recognize that trying and not succeeding can still give really valuable experiences that make, make you more likely to succeed in the next go-around. ATI is currently aiding pharmaceutical startup Savara. CEO Rob Neville took over when the company was initially based in Kansas City, but with little funding in sight, he decided to move the company to Austin. Savara is doing quite well as a result of the environment that I think Austin brings to bear. We have been successful raising um, funds. We have a runway through 2012. Um, which is uh, great for a young company. Um, we have to now meet the milestones that are ahead of us to, to um, attract uh, venture capital money. Being in the business of developing next generation respiratory therapeutics is no walk in the park. The interesting thing in the life science space versus like this, the engineering space that I came from is each stage of development could fail. And uh, whereas in the engineering world, you can control and perhaps by taking a little more time in the life science space, every stage can fail. After selling his first company back in 2000, a stroke left Rob paralyzed from the neck down. He eventually made a full recovery, but the experience left him wanting to do something more with his life. So one of my uh, personal um, missions for my own life is to, is to leave an impact on the world, and uh, the, uh, the life science uh, industry is a way to do that, um, as opposed to building the next widget for an iPhone. Nothing wrong with doing that. but. For me, I wanted to do something that would be significant and would uh, personally leave a mark on marginalized people. These are the, the lost, the hurting, the let down people in the world. And uh, Savara was.